Shatrugan Sinha now speaking like uh, the congressman uh, for attacking his own party after Prime Minister Modi claimed that Pakistan was colluding with Congress party and interfering in Gujarat elections. Remember Prime Minister Modi while campaigning in Gujarat made a scathing attack on the Congress party and claimed that Pakistan was indeed interfering in the Gujarat assembly polls to back the grand old party. He also claimed that Congress leader Manishankar Iyer along with other Congress leaders including Manmohan Singh had met Pakistani delegates and that Pakistani delegation wanted Ahmed Patel to be the Chief Minister of Gujarat. Herman joins us live for more on this. Herman, now it is Shatrugan Sinha who is attacking Prime Minister Modi and BJP over the Congress Park link that Prime Minister has been speaking about. Well, that's right, Hina, and in fact, I can just tell you, uh, it was just a few minutes ago that uh, Congress leader Manish Tiwari has in fact tweeted and he says, and I quote, uh, rather than calumny of Narendra Modi and Amit Shah, have the gumption, let them openly say that a gentleman who was the Prime Minister of India for 10 years and another gentleman who was the Vice President of India uh, for a decade were conspiring with Pakistan to influence uh, the Gujarat elections. Otherwise, apologize as soon as possible, unquote. That is the tweet that has been coming in uh, from Manish Tiwari. But yes, as you are rightly pointing out, it is one of the own from the BJP who has been attacking them and that is Shatrugan Sinha and let me tell you the entire uh, narrative as such for the elections which started on on the Gujarat model of development and the and the catch word being your Vikas or other development has day by day shifting uh, goalposts you have personal name calling like Manishankar Iyer from the Congress who's, uh, who called the Prime Minister Nietzsche to now the Prime Minister saying there openly that uh, senior leaders from the Congress were conspiring uh, with leaders from Pakistan and were meddling in the Gujarat elections a very serious charge in fact coming in from the Prime Minister himself in his home turf here while campaigning for the Gujarat elections. And do remember the Congress has been saying that these are unverified reports and uh, this is something that, ha that they've been relying on fake news reports rather and therefore that is what the Prime right. Minister has been saying all uh, during his campaigning is what, has, uh, is what the Congress has been alleging. So what right? words Herman clearly getting ugly. Thank you very much for joining us and putting things in perspective. We'll keep coming back to you for more on this.